my channel it's your girl shawnee and guess what we back with another one we back with another one i hope everybody's having a great day i myself am having a great day you guys this book is inspired by summer this is my summer full of color eyeshadow look so i hope you guys enjoy this we're not going to take too much of your time we're going to get right into this but before we go make sure you like subscribe comment hit that post notification bell so you can be the first to know when your girl is dropping a new video also follow me on all social media platforms as usual i'll put my handles on the screen here and you guys if you're feeling my uh spring twist i did post a video tutorial on a tutorial and review of this hair so go ahead and watch my last video and we're gonna get into this you guys see it on the flip side peace all right let's get started okay so we're going in and we're going to start with our eyebrow as you can see i already have a one eye partially complete and we're just going in with a eyebrow pencil and you guys this eyebrow pencil i think i got from like dollar tree <laughs> it's just a regular old um, eyebrow pencil in a dark brown color and uh, you can use any eyebrow pencil that you have or you can get it from dollar tree like i did and we're just going in and perfecting that eye i'm also going in with my elf eyebrow kit in the color dark brown or it's either deep brown or dark brown and uh, we're going in and just filling in that brow, making it super dark. And now I'm just going in with my Pro Concealer in the color Fawn. And we're going right on top of our eyebrow and we're just cleaning that up. And then we'll go in and just blend it out using a sponge. And you see me kind of working it into the eyebrow as well to give kind of a natural fading effect. And now I'm going in this time, this is the first time you see me doing this, under my eye, I'm going in with my foundation, my Juvia's Place Eye Magic Foundation. So it is my color Nairobi. And the reason I'm doing this is because for this look, I want it to appear as if there's only eyeshadow on my lid or my cut crease. So I'm going in and just blending that out. Now I'm going in with my micellar cleansing water and we are cutting our crease and we're going in a sort of a wing shaped crease. And you just wanna make sure you clean up any excess foundation because we want this base to be nice and clean for the white P. Louise base, which I am applying now. This is the color Rumor Zero. This is totally white because we want these colors to pop. What's tapping? And you're just following that line that you created. And we're going to just fill in that area with some more of that base. Boom, ba -dum, boom, boom, ba -dum, boom, base. And now that we got the base on, I'm just using a brush 
just smooth out that area so that we can have a nice smooth application when we start to put on our eyeshadow. And it's okay if you go a little out the lines on the bottom half of that wing because we will clean it up. Now I'm just taking some white eyeshadow, any white eyeshadow will do, and just setting that base so that we can minimize any crease. And now I'm going back in with that cleansing water and we're cleaning up the area where we went out of the lines. Alrighty, now we're going in with our James, James, yeah, James Charles palette. That would be the only palette we're using for this look and we're gonna be using five colors out of this palette. The first color I'm going in with is that green color called Social Blade. Then I'll be going in with the yellow color called B. Then an orange color called 518. Then we're going in with the red color called You're Kidding. <laughs> and then lastly, this pretty pink color called Skip. So we're just applying, when you're applying your eyeshadow, these colors, make sure you pack on a lot of color before you move to the next one. So you just want to build it up as much as you can. Once you're satisfied with the color payoff, you'll start to blend the two colors together. So once you got it all put on where you want it, you just go where the two colors meet and just slightly swipe back and forth for a nice blend. And now I'm going in with that orange color. And this color I really had to build up. Now I'm going in with the red color. This color is really pretty, you guys. Okay, now I've seen some areas that I didn't like, so I went back in with that orange color and tried to build it just a little bit more. I did the same with the yellow color because it was not popping enough for me. So I just went back in and just added some more color and blended it out a little bit more. Now I'm topping it off with that pretty pink color. And it is okay if you get outside of the lines a little bit because we are gonna go in and clean it up once again. Just adding a little bit more red for better blending. And like I said, we're going in and just cleaning up that pink that got outside of the lines there. Now I'm going in with my NYX uh, liquid liner in white. And we are just outlining the outer portion of that wing. We are not taking this liner all the way around the cut crease. Just the outer portion. Kind of right where, well, halfway uh, to where that red is, if that's making sense. We're not going to take it all the way across the red color. Just kind of halfway there. And I'm trying my best to match it up with my other eye. And now I'm just going in with my NYX Epic Ink Liner. And I love this liner because it's a marker and it just makes it easier to do wings for me. So I do enjoy using this marker. And we are making our wing go right to where that white stops. I went a little bit too far into the white on this side, but that's okay, you'll see me go back in and kind of fix it.
And so I just took that white liner and took it right on top of that black, right at the tip. And I also just went over my liner because I wanted it to be really white because once you put it on top of the pink, it kind of turned a light pink color. Now I am all done. I do all my Sumptuous Beauty lashes. And this is in the style Moscow. And I put on my foundation. I did my face off camera. And I am all set to go. You guys, I still have that promo code Simply Shawnee 2 if you want to get in on these, la these lashes. So I'll leave it in the description below. But that's it, my loves. Peace out. I hope you enjoy.